here with Stan and Patrick. This is as good as it's going to get. I love that. <laughs> Bring in things. Did you ever hit somebody on purpose? I wanted to throw the ball inside. Unfortunately, Cangelosi stood two inches. It was unfair. It wasn't going after him. Ryan Thompson hit the grand slam off of me. Oh, Cangelosi was next? He was next. And I said, you know what? I'm throwing the next pitch inside. And I did. It hit him. He charged the mound. Bobby Bonilla had the greatest line ever because Ryan Klesko was playing right field. He made three errors on two plays. Bobby Bonilla said, you should hit Klesko. He's the guy that got you in this <laughs> the Steve Alford joining us. Did you play against Jordan? The one time I do remember facing him, and I was put in as a timeout. I like tackle Paxton and I said hey no disrespect but I'm guarding you I'm not guarding the other guy Jordan makes a pass to the wing and I hear Derek Harper yell switch and I see who I'm getting ready to switch to and I yell switch back <laughs> so I took great pride in trying to stay off of posters when I played in the NBA He's Jalen Rose from the Mothership. More explosive score, Kobe or Mike? I have to say Kobe because I was standing there watching him get 81 points. <laughs> I'm not much of a test study. I was standing there watching LeBron James have his career high 55 too. Is that a coincidence, Jalen, that you're on the floor when these guys put up career numbers? Uh, you know, it's a coincidence or maybe a trend. <laughs> He's Jerry West, the uh, Lakers Hall of Famer. I know you love your job, but it still bothers me that you're not with the Lakers. Does it bother you at all? I love the Lakers, okay? And it's a different situation now, different time. I, sometimes I thought in my life that maybe that might be something that I can revisit or they would want me to re revisit, but that, that didn't happen. But to say that I would, wouldn't have liked to end ended my career there, that wouldn't necessarily be true either. Dodger pitcher Clayton Kershaw joining us. What's that moment like when somebody leaves the batter's box going to the mound? I don't know if I'm allowed to admit that I've hit a few guys on purpose in my day, but I think you I just have. did. <laughs> yeah, so you know, I haven't had anybody, you know, start that walk out. Do you have a game plan here? I mean, I have a game plan. I mean, I, in my head, I know exactly what I'm going to do. It's going to be like a Kyle Farnsworth situation. You know, just go up there and form tackle the guy. Sexy show with Stan Patrick. This is as good as it's going to get. I love that. The Dan Patrick Show, weekday mornings on audience.